All right, I just wanted to make a quick video about um, the Harris famous roach tablets. Um, I looked on YouTube and I didn't see too many decent videos on this. Just like really quick videos. Um, um, so I wanted to make, you know, make a quick video, but a little longer than 30 seconds. I mean, that's, that's crazy. These things are amazing. Um, if you have any kind of issue, even if you don't have an issue with roaches, it's a great way to prevent it. Um, I don't see too, too many roaches in my house, except um, around the summertime, they get to be a little worse. But, I've, you know, I don't have an infestation or anything in the main part of my house. Now, um, around this time of year, around summer, I do start seeing a little more here and there. But um, I wanted to clear up a misconception about these. Because when you use them, you're going to see more roaches. So I didn't really hardly see any roaches in my house when I, when I put these in my attic. And now I'm starting to see them. Um, because basically they, um, they come down, like, they start looking for water. You know, they, they eat some of this and then they start looking for water. So you're going to start seeing more of them. Um, but I wanted to give a suggestion for people who have tried this and they didn't have any luck with it to um, take some tablets and um put you know take a little container and put bacon grease in it and dip some of these in bacon grease and then in a separate container um dip them and completely cover them in peanut butter and um go up in your attic or your basement oh excuse me go up in your attic or your basement and just like throw them around um make sure that the covers you know they're scattered around really good and within a couple of days, you will start seeing roaches come down, look for water. They'll be like halfway dead or, or you'll, you'll even see them like fully dead. Um, and what happens with these is that even the roaches that eat it and die from it, it's really gross. But, you know, roaches, that's how they survive for so long. They eat each other. So the roaches that actually have died from this, um, they will try to eat on the other roach and they will die. So it, it starts this cascade effect of them just um dying one after the other so it's great you know for if you have an infestation i've i've read stories of people who've had like infestations for a really long time um i saw two in one night and i never really do that but that's mainly because i've put these in the attic i just wanted to make sure it didn't become a problem i already had um, an issue with mosquitoes in my house so i don't i know that these are something i trust every year and they work so well, and it's only like $6 a box. I mean, you can't beat that. Um, and uh, I put a lot, too, and you can see I still have like half a box. And I put a crap load of tablets in my attic. I don't recommend, um, I mean, you can put them under the fridge, like areas that you know that your animals and kids aren't going to be able to, to get around. Um, but I've heard horror stories of like animals that accidentally ended up eating this. You'd so be very, very, very careful when putting these around the main part of your house. So that's why I always suggest like the attic is a really great place because, um, you know, it's dark and they roaches just love attics and things like that. So yeah, just be really weary about where you're going to put them, um, places where you have food at that you're going to eat because it is boric acid. So Anyway, um, I hope this helps, and um, if you have any questions, just ask me in the comments.